Hey guys, welcome back to the Portsmouth career mode. What a depressing day it is for football. If you don't know what's going on around in the world of football right now, then I really suggest you read into it because it's pretty scary stuff right now. But I didn't want it to get in the way of uploading my Portsmouth Road to Glory. I absolutely love this series. Nothing is going to get in the way, so we're kicking off this week. And today, I'm proud to say it is sponsored by FOTMOB. The best way to describe FOTMOB is the ultimate football app at your fingertips. You can get all the information you could ever want and it's right there in your pocket or these days at home on your desk. Uh, it's an incredible app. I've used it for years. Today, guys, I, I really suggest you check out the news in the app, the uh, the news feed. It's, it's depressing. It really is. What's going on right now in the world of football is truly terrifying. Please read up on it. It has everything you need to know, including Mourinho being sacked from Tottenham. Is that because he has decided not to support their choice in being involved? Tottenham are involved in this. I'm ashamed to be an Arsenal fan. I, I think I will be doing a video on this at another time. Um, crazy. It's absolutely crazy. So please download the app, guys. And, you know, not only read the news, you can also check out all the fixtures coming up tomorrow. The game tonight, Leeds versus Liverpool. It has everything you need in one place. What more could you want? And it's completely free on Android and iOS. So please click that link down in the description. Make sure you download FOTMOB and let's crack on with the episode. Our first game of the episode is an FA Cup game against Barrow. So this should be... I hope, an easy win. Where are they right now? Are they in League 2? I'm actually going to double check this because I'm not 100% sure. I have a feeling they're in League 2. Barrow, Barrow, where are you? Barrow are 14th in League 2. So, yeah, if I don't win this, that would be truly embarrassing. Don't forget, guys, we are in the transfer window now. We have some things to take care of, but let's get this game done first. We will go ahead and jump into a match simulation. By the way... I've updated all my mods with their creators. Thank you to Liam, everyone that helped me uh, get the mods up to date. And hopefully the third kit will now work because the referee that had the full black uniform, we've got a different color. So hopefully that's going to work. But anyway, into the first game of the episode. It's a strong side we've put out, arguably our best side. And I'm expecting a big result. We should have scored there. It flashed across the front of the goal. Maybe we're going to get another chance here. Go on. Get in there. Oh, wow. Nope, we've still got it. Come on, Curtis. Yes, there it is. 1-0. Just on side by the looks of it. It looked close. Is it going to be 2-0? We're playing so well. You can tell, though, that Barrow are struggling here. They can't get out of their own half. Oh, I think they're going to. Oh, my God. Nope. <laughs> we tackled them on the halfway line, and we get on the attack again. Curtis... Into the box, and it's 2-0. It's Nelson. He won the tackle on the halfway line, did he not? So he's gone all the way forward, and he's made it 2-0. One more goal, and you know the rest is history, guys. It will be game over. Look at this. What are the stats looking like at the moment? Wow. Five shots to none. We haven't dominated the possession as much as I thought we had, but guys, this could be 3-0. Come on. Oh, I think he's hit the bar or the post there. Unlucky. Well, there it is. Rogers makes it 3-0. It only took 33 minutes, guys. There is no need to finish this match. We actually conceded 42 minutes in. No substitutions. No surprise there. But we've got into the next round with a very, very easy 3-1. I probably should have rested some players there, but it's okay. Man City make it through against Norwich. That was the standout one there for me. For some reason, I saw Norwich and saw them lose. We got lucky to have Barrow. We got one of the easiest draws we could have got. Uh, quick update on the league table, of course, because we haven't been uploading this for two days. It's over the weekend. I don't post career mode on the weekends. You guys know that. Uh, we are in sixth place, 48 points, three points above Norwich. I guess that's why it stood out to me. They are one of our rivals. And um, at the moment, Brighton and Crystal Palace are running away with the league. So I think top six is definitely possible. I think we're going to get into the playoffs at this rate. So don't forget, because it's the window, we will be potentially losing a player or two. One of those players, it looks like it's going to be Ellis Harrison. He is refusing to sign a new contract and he's only got six months left. So we are going to try and cash in. We've took an offer of 1.2 million. We accepted it. 
Whether that's going to go through or not, I don't know. And also, as you guys know, I updated you on the last episode that Harry Day... It is Harry, isn't it? Yeah, it says it there. For a moment, I thought it was Harvey. Harry Day will be staying with the club. Um, it's the game kind of glitching out and it's it's stupid. So we will be keeping him for the rest of this season. I'm guessing we're going to find out if Harrison goes. There it is. Harrison is gone. Honestly, I, I really didn't want it to come to that, but it is what it is. 1.2 million, which means we get £875,000 in the transfer budget. We've got an offer here for Johnson and also Dyson. Wow. Okay, Johnson right back has a release clause. Oh, they're offering me a swap deal. Okay, I'm, I'm not in, interested in Madranda, that's for sure. However, I wouldn't necessarily say no to selling Johnson. How much money would we have if we let him go? Out of interest. We have, at the moment, 3.6 million, so let's call it 5. If we can get to 5 million, that does mean we can invest quite significantly into a new signing. But where the hell does that new signing play? I'm really happy with my squad, so he would probably be a backup player. I'm really happy with my bench as well. Like, wh Where does a new player fit in? I've got two wingers that I like, a striker that I like. I guess Stevenson is one of the players that maybe isn't fitting what I'm looking to do at the moment. He isn't quite at that level. I, I don't know what it is. He's 71 rated. He really shouldn't be that bad, but I just haven't been able to get the best out of him since Hogg came in. So I guess that's a position we could potentially improve in. Udabajo, what more? Close. Yeah, I don't, I don't really need to sign... I don't need to sign anyone. I'm quite happy to keep that money. You know, I don't need to spend money just because I've got it. So what I'm going to do is decline the Dyson offer. There's no way I'm selling him. But with Johnson, I'm going to go ahead and delegate here. I do not want to do a player swap. I will ask for 2.3 million. Wait, how much is he worth? 1.7. Yeah, I'm going to go 2.3. But I would, I would take 2 million. Anything less than that, and it's just not worth it. If he sells, then maybe we'll look into signing a player. But, you know, I, I don't actually think we need to do it. I wasn't expecting that. They've actually come back and said they'll pay 2.15 million. So if Johnson goes, that means, obviously, Udabajo and Minoga would still be my first choice right backs. But who is the third choice? Let's just double check this isn't a silly sale. You know, I don't want to accidentally do something silly um I guess Robinson could play right back if I absolutely needed him to he's pretty pacey uh we've got Brown he's a left back Galloway oh I don't know actually I, I guess you could probably put Nelson at right back as well let me see what was his rate what would his rating be oh wow that really isn't that bad he could easily play at right back interesting okay do you know what I'm gonna do it because eventually these kind of players will leave because I I don't see how Johnson's going to get into my Premier League side eventually. And uh, to take that kind of money now, I think is the right thing to do. So he'll be going over to the MLS. Good luck, Callum Johnson. Please accept the contract. You're not going to be playing here. By the way, that reminds me, we've got a new face for Minoga. An updated texture. The hair was glitching out. I don't know if you noticed in the last episode. So hopefully it's going to work a little bit better. But this looks incredible. Wizard mods, mate. You are a genius. Now it's time for Birmingham, and this is actually a really important game. I, I need to win this. I'm going to go with a 5-3-2, but don't worry. My wing-backs are going to push forward. I am going to bring Minoga in. I'm going to play him as a centre-back, so we're going to go like that. At right wing-back, we will go with... Oh, hang on. What do I do here? I'm going to go... I mean, Udabajo obviously plays at right wing-back, but do we go with Wilkes up front with Rogers? Uh, no, I'm going to go with Hunter. I want to give Hunter a go. He's obviously left-footed. We'll play him on the right side. Rogers on the left side. Wilkes can come on as a second-half sub if need be. But don't forget, Birmingham are one of our rivals. Them and Norwich, they seem to be the, the nearest to us right now. Hogg is going to play a slightly deeper role. Chalaber in midfield, captain. And then Nelson just to the right. It's a really strong team. I will be pushing my wing-backs forward. So effectively, it's a 3-5-2, really. Is it going to work, though, with the referees having a black shirt? Ooh, I don't know if it's worked. Sometimes mods don't do what you expect them to do, and I haven't had a chance to test it. It doesn't It doesn't seem to be working. 
Okay. Well, I guess I guess we'll go back in and try and sort that again. It is too it is too difficult to distinguish if you're passing to a, a teammate or not. It is it is actually a big problem. It makes it so much harder. It looks like I've got an extra midfielder when I just don't. But anyway, let's see if we can win this game comfortably anyway. Halilovic plays for Birmingham, doesn't he? Oh my god. Who remembers when he was the next big thing playing for Barcelona? Oh, crazy, isn't it? Oh no. Oh, I've given away a penalty. Robinson slides in a bit late. It could be a red. I hope it's not. Oh, it is. Guys, we're down to 10 men after 10 minutes. That's a problem. It's a bad challenge, but it's not a red card. There's no way that's a red card. I disagree, but that changes everything. That's not good news. Okay, what more will have to come in? Oh, I, obviously I can't sub him. Hang on, how am I going to do this? I guess we take off a striker. I'm so sorry, Hunter. I'm so sorry, but it has to be you. What more in the middle? Minoga there. Unfortunately, we have to get rid of a striker. So Rogers will play down the middle on his own. Looks like a Christmas tree, the formation. Not ideal. What a terrible start to the game. Double jeopardy, right? Ah, oh, damn. I should have stayed in the middle. Damn. Not only are we down to 10 men, we're 1-0 down as well now. This game, I'm afraid, is not looking great. Damage limitation now? Or do we just go for it? Maybe we just go for it. Let's see what happens. Obviously, though, guys, the odds are I'm probably going to concede again as well. So we do need to make sure we limit them as much as we can. That was not very good defending at all. Here they come again. Oh, I thought that said McCree then. Overwatch fans, you know who I mean. Oh, no. That's bad. Okay, I think we're all right. We're just going to leather that one out to Rogers, And it's straight back to Halilovic. Yeah, this is going to be a long, painful game at this rate. I just tried to pass to the referee. Okay, I need to really focus. Don't pass to the referee. Just don't do it. He doesn't have the white ankle tape looking socks. Okay. Pass it onto the right side. Hello. Odibarjo. Back post for Rogers. Nope. Not a good pass, but we'll keep that one in, hopefully. There we go. Just about into Hog. Uh, okay, we'll keep that. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Across the keeper. Oh, good save there by Etheridge. What a game. This has been mental so far. Let's cross it in and hope someone can get on the end of it. Day's in there. Oh, wow. Go on, Hog. Into Rogers. Pass it on the edge of the box. Oh, Chalibur's just got there. Over to Hog. First time strike, and it's straight at the defender. Do you know what? We've actually been all right since we've gone down to 10 men. We really have not been too bad, but have I spoke too soon? Maybe. Nope, great tackle there from Monoga. Man, what a player he is. I noticed, I, I went on his Twitter, he's got like 3,000 followers. How mad is that? Go and follow Monoga on Twitter. He's becoming a bit of a hero in this career mode. I love him. The real problem is I'm having to be quite defensive off the ball, get players back. And then it leaves me a little bit, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? A little bit outnumbered when I go forward, <laughs> basically. I don't have enough men forward, so we'll, we'll see what happens. But I think in this second half, we're probably only going to get one big chance, and I'll just have to take it. Let's play this one forward. I didn't mean to go backwards a second ago. Into Rogers now. Is this, this the big chance? Nope. Tried to pass it into Hog. It didn't quite work out. It's coming. I, I'm feeling good. I reckon we can do this. This is it. This is the moment. Okay. We're going to chip that to Rogers. It's a good first touch. Into Hog. Gone to the left side. No. Roberts just stepped in at the right time. Try and win this back as soon as we can. Chalibur can't get it. Oh, it's so annoying when they pass it around you like that. You feel like you're so close to getting the ball. And then they take it away from you again. All right. We're going to have to make some changes, I think. We're doing all right. I just need one big moment. And do you know what? I'm going to risk it for a biscuit. Okay, we're going to do a bit of a janky formation here. But do you know what? Cummings is coming on to save the day. He's going to score. And close. Instead of Chalibur. Let's do it. What have I got to lose? We're losing 1-0. We've got 15 minutes to go. Let's go for it. Close may not be the best defensive option compared to Chalibur. But he might get forward and get us a winner. As he has done a couple of times this season so far. That's a good ball. Come on. This might be it. That big chance I've been talking about. 
Come on. Here is close. Back to Rogers. Udebarjo. Oh, it's a bad ball. No. And now I'm light at the back. I've been getting players forward. No. Don't do this to me now. Don't do this to me. Come on, what more? Get stuck in. Oh, my God. Thankfully, it's a rubbish cross. But we're not going to get it back. Just a few moments left here. Oh, here we go. Cummings to rescue the day. Come on. Just keep running. Don't stop for anything. We've got a runner. Nelson back. We've got Rogers in the middle. Just go for it. Oh. I think that might be it. I think that might be just it. What a shame. Do you know what? We've done, we've done us proud. I've done us proud. I've played okay with 10 men against one of the teams right near us in the league table. They are a good side. But I, I threw this game away within the first 10 minutes, unfortunately. And there we have it. Confirmation that Callum Johnson has been sold. 1.6 million. We'll take it. Robinson, of course, will be suspended for a game because of that red card. Technically, it should be three, right? So... Thank God that's not in the game. Three games without our main centre-back. Although, is he our main centre-back? I would argue that Day is just as important. But since Robinson got into the side, I just haven't been able to drop him. He's been fantastic for us. Back to Fratton Park now. And we are taking on Coventry, I think it was. Yeah, Coventry City. We've got Wilkes coming back in on that right side. Cummings starts on the left side. So just a couple of changes to the team. Back to the 4-2-3-1 formation as well. Let's see if that gives us a little bit more of an edge in this game. Hopefully, we just won't get sent off. Get a man sent off in the first 10 minutes. That would really help the most. Oh, that's going to be a yellow card. I'm making some bad challenges today. Oh, no. Oh, my God. They just absolutely rinsed me. And look at the time. It's not even 10 minutes in again. What is with me starting so poorly... And just ruining my chances so early. It, it doesn't make any sense. That tackle, though, is bad. I, I've completely missed it. Dyson nowhere near it as well. We deserve to be 1-0 down after that. Terrible start to the game. Again. That's a good throw. Rogers. Over to Nelson. Oh, back to Rogers here. Oh, my God. That was good defending. Here we go, though. Wilkes is in. And Wilkes equalizes. Get in there. It's 1-0. I love him. I love him so much. Wilkes, you are an absolute beast. Even on that right foot, he is banging in goals. Love it. That shot that was blocked. Very unfortunate that it bounced straight back to Chalaba there, who gets the assist. And we're back in the game. Come on. Oh, look at the space here for Nelson. Just keep running. Keep running. No! How's he done that? The defender just somehow got a touch on it. We go again, though. One, two. Put it through. No. That wasn't ever going to work. This is good, though. Yes, we conceded early. Yes, it was terrible. But since then, we have improved massively. What well on Cummings. Look at that as well. Play it forward now if we can. Here we go. Hog. Nope. Nope. Give it back. Here we go. Gorm. Wilkes. He's in again. Near post. Oh, he's done it again. You cannot stop Wilkes. 77 rated. I mean, <laughs> I was talking about Brighton and how they've got Dela Cruz over 80 rated. We're almost there. Wilkes is pretty much Premier League level at this point. He's insane. What a goal. Oh, play it through. Go on. Oh, it's not a great pass, but Holt still gets it from Cummings. Here we go. Is it going to be three? I might hit this. Oh, my God. I think it was probably just going wide. Still, the keeper made the save. Let's throw that to Nelson. I'm going to play it back to Minoga here. Into Hog. Or Rogers. That's fine. Rogers trying to get that shot away. And it's uh, it's well defended in the end. And I think that's going to be it for the first half. We turned it around really quickly. And that's always a good thing. I love to see it. When I start badly but still get a decent result at half time, it's a good thing. He just did me. Wow. That was ridiculous. What a save from Dyson. You see that little fake turn, whatever you want to call it. He completely sold it. And I, I went for the tackle. And I looked stupid. It's a good corner as well. What more's there? Oh, no. They're going to recycle this and get a shot from it by the looks of it. Oh, oh my God. We're okay. We're okay. Now it's up here on the left side for Cummings. He's rapid. Go. Just keep running. Look at Rogers in the middle. 
Can we pick him out? I think we can. Can he finish it though? Of course he can. It's 3-1. Is that going to be enough? I think it might be. Cummings though, fantastic run and pass. But it was all about the finish. The keeper came out, no chance. Good night. I think it's probably enough. Oh, it could get worse here. Wilkes is in. What should we do from here? He's on the hat trick. I've got to go for it, right? I've got to go for it. Oh, he's almost got it. So close. We're going to get this with Holt. Into Chalaba. Over to Cummings. Into Hogg. Over to Nelson. Oh, he's just ran into trouble. Couldn't get the ball out of his feet. Come on, Wilkes. We're going to get you a hat trick. It will be done. Good tackle. Hogg. Into Minoga. Can he finish it? He can. We're now winning 4-1. Who would have guessed it after nine minutes when I went 1-0 down that we'd actually be 4-1 up? Not too late into the second half. Absolutely blown them away. I said I'd try and do it. I've gone for it with the long shot. How close was it though? Let's have a look. I'm guessing it was very close. It really was. We're running out of time though. 15 minutes to get Wilkes' hat trick. I'm going to make a couple of changes now. Let's give Stevenson another go. I'm also going to bring in Hunter because he was taken off early in the last game. And let's go ahead and bring in Curtis as well. It's pretty sad, isn't it, that all of a sudden Cummings, a young player, is taking Curtis's spot in the team. Captain of the club, but honestly, he's just so good. Oh, we're in. Surely now. Yes, it's done. The hat trick for Wilkes. Run to the camera. Oh, I ran to the linesman, not the camera. Well done, Matt. Great job. I was hoping we'd get one of those cool celebrations with his face like in the camera. But who cares about the celebration? It's about the goals. Three goals. Hunter's first touch of the ball gets an assist. What a finish. Another goal with his right foot as well. He's so damn good. Oh, it's going to be six. Lovely pass from Stevenson. Can Hunter finish it? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Unreal. He shot. It was saved. And it pinged off his leg. And it almost crossed the line. Should be 6-1. Oh, fair play, Stevenson. He's been great. What a ball that is. Okay. It would have been better if I took it first time. Play it into the middle. Into Nelson now. Play it back. Stevenson. Oh, man. He's playing better. Do you know what? I did something silly, right? I changed his boots and I thought maybe that would help. I don't know why. Just sometimes it does. It, they just feel like a new player. He was brilliant when he came on. He did more than Hogg. A hat trick for Wilkes. Man of the match. 10 out of 10 performance. Incredible game from him. We've got Preston up next and I've decided to give Stevenson a start and Hunter as well. Rogers is going to start on that left side because why not? We know he can already do that. Uh, Holt on the left side, Minogue on the right, Robinson is back in the team after serving his suspension, Chalibur and Nelson, I can't drop either of them, they've been so good for us, and of course the man in form, Wilkes, on that right side, look at his stats, 86 pace, but basically it's 90, his shooting is 69, I'm hoping that we can get that to 70 soon, because then he's got green stats in everything but his defending, you know, that's, that's going to be really nice, this is a strong team, and I think Preston were in 14th place. So even though we're going away from home, this should be another three points. And we need it to keep up with Birmingham after we lost to them earlier. That's a good start here from Preston. It's Sinclair. Wilkes getting back and doing his defensive work. And here we go. We can get on the break here. Into Rogers. I'm just going to run here. Could have given it to Hunter. We still can, but I think I go solo here. Come on, Rogers. And there it is. He's ridiculous, isn't he? Guys, for once, we haven't conceded in the first opening 10 minutes. We've scored in the opening 10 minutes. Fantastic start, even though it was all Preston, wasn't it? They, they got the ball through into a good position. All it took was one ball over the top from the defence and then a pass up to Rodgers and then ended with this. I do feel kind of bad for Watmore, though, because he came in and did a great job for me. He emailed me and said, thanks for putting me back in the team. And then as soon as Robinson's back from his suspension, he's back in the team. Yeah, I feel kind of bad about that. What more has been great for us? But the, the further we go up into the leagues, the more I'm going to realise that the, the players that were here by default, God, that was horrible, aren't going to be at the level we really need. Robinson is just the better centre-back. Just, it, it's as simple as that. 
I do just feel bad about maybe, you know, just dropping them as soon as my other players available and not playing them on merit. I'm playing them because of who they are, if that makes sense. Look at this, though. Chalaber's in, if we can find him. Go on, Chalaber. Finish that. Oh, he's hit the post. Okay, now, I know he's not a striker, but why the hell would you hit that with your left foot? Why? You're right-footed, mate. Just bend that in. Oh, should be two. Here is Wilkes again. Going on that left foot. Into Stevenson. It's a bad pass. Oh, Nelson. Through for Hunter. Can he finish it? Oh, my God. How is it only 1-0? We are absolutely all over them. Pass this one short to Stevenson. Do you know what? From here, a cheeky finesse shot. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No one saw that. No one saw that. That was a finesse shot. Wow. Stevenson. We need to work on your shooting, mate. Oh, we've got it back. Into Hunter. Wilkes is making a run. That's a foul. Come on. That is just so good from Day. He's put us on the attack. Here goes Nelson now. Go on, Nelson. Across the keeper. Oh, my God. <laughs> what is up with some of my shooting today? Wow. That was beautiful from Day, though. He picks up the ball. He takes on a man. He runs into midfield. And he sets up the attack. That's what I love about Day. He's quick as well. He's, he's no slouch, that's for sure. Look at him getting stuck in again there. And there it is. Half time. Really, really good first half. But do you know what? We haven't put away our chances. We should be done with this game. We should be at least 2 or 3 nil up. But it's okay. More goals will come. What? Oh my god, what a ball. I wasn't expecting that to work. Over here to Rogers now. No, I've ruined it. Absolutely ruined it. Can we get it back though? No, we've lost it again. There's no way. Oh my god. It's in off the post. There's no way this is happening. There is no way I'm not going to win this game. After all of these chances. No. There's no way. We can't. We can't let that happen. We've still got half an hour. We have to score. This would be a travesty. I've had about seven or eight shots on target. It is time for the game changers. Curtis and Hogg both coming on now. Is it too late? I hope not. There's plenty of time for them to get involved. There's Hogg. Straight into Wilkes. And now Curtis. I don't think he's going to quite get there. Damn it. Okay, right. Just focus. Don't concede again. No. No! There's no way! There is no, 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 no way! Oh, I, I just can't believe it. I cannot believe it. What's that? Three shots on target. Two goals. My God. There's no way we have any chance of getting promoted if we play like this and not put my chances away. Come on. We've still got a bit of time left. Chalaber into Rogers, who is now playing up front. Into Hogg, who decides to jump over the ball and slow himself down. Oh. Oh, we almost got it back. What is that? I'm done. I'm done. I can't believe it. I have no idea what's happened. How has that happened? What is that pass? I mean, it's an unreal goal. The passing there. Oh, end it. I just quit the game. I just jumped to result. I, I can't. I cannot play any more of that match. Oh, my God. Wow. Okay. Good news is, though, we picked up a very good draw in the round four of the FA Cup as we get an offer from Crystal Palace for Harry Day. I'm sorry. It ain't happening. It's a very good offer, but no, absolutely not. Uh, we got Sheffield Wednesday in the FA Cup. So again, we've avoided some massive teams. Man City are still in there. Southampton, Fulham, Watford, those are good teams. We also could have played Wolves, Everton, Leicester, 
uh, Arsenal, Liverpool, Chelsea. There's some really big teams in there. So, again, we've got very lucky and you never know. M maybe we'll go on a really good FA Cup run. Maybe we'll somehow get to a quarterfinal or something. But uh, for now, guys, I'm done. There's, there's no way, no way that happened. I cannot believe it. Oh, geez. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to FopMob for sponsoring this episode. Make sure you check out the app down below. I highly recommend it. Follow them on social media as well if you want to. Uh, it's a free app. I love it. I use it all the time. You guys know I don't promote stuff unless I genuinely like the product. So please do check it out. It's free on iOS and Android. Link in the description. And I will see you tomorrow for another episode. And also soon I will make a video talking about the Super League rubbish.